Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. So I just got a box from my buddy, Tony, and it was earmarked for Coach Rob and me. It's a surprise. Don't open it. Stay tuned. All right, guys, we're walking up to Coach Rob. What's up, Harry? How are you, Coach? I'm good. How about you? Good, good. Whoa. Good. What do you got? So, Tony, our our fan um, and friend Tony Bryant from Florida, sent us a box, and he's like, don't open it until you see Coach Rob. Okay. So, I, I kind of opened it just so that I could get it started, right. but I haven't looked inside. Okay. Um but feel this it's isn't it kind of weird it's kind of heavy <laughs> kind of feels like maybe there's more than one racket in there yeah but it's like really heavy though maybe three? i mean there's like four or five or six rackets in here the way this feels so here's the instructions of tony he said open the thing open the box and look in the right side bag or the open the bag first so here's the bag Okay. I'm going to let you take a look at that. Hey, Wilson. I know. At least it's well. He knows nice. you. He knows Coach Rob is all about Wilson. Oh. Huh. Am I supposed to hit you with what this? What is that? Is this a mallet? Oh, or? it looks like it didn't survive the shipping. Uh, is this for cricket? I. That's a great question. <laughs> is it a teaching aid? I mean, it looks like it got broken. I wonder if it was intact during shipping. But We'll have to find oh. out from Tony. But at least there's a tennis racket. Oh, look, there's a tennis racket grip on oh, it. Oh, he found it's a, a prince. prince. Well, can't get them all right. And it, oh, man, that's weird. I, I've never, I mean, I've never lived in England, and there's no cricket out here to my knowledge that I know about. But that's what this looks like is a cricket thing, and that's what's weighing a ton. Right. He's got a Wilson grip on there, though. No wonder he said, I would like to see the looks on your face. Uh, I would like to see the looks. I would like to see the looks on your face when you open it. So <laughs> I guess you see our puzzled looks with this. <laughs> I don't know what you call this, but um, I guess it's a cricket paddle. We'll find out okay. when we find out from Tony. Okay. Well, thanks, Tony. <laughs> Let's... <laughs> Okay, let's see what else is in here. That's what was weighing a ton, because that thing weighs like a baseball bat. Oh. Wow. Look, a blacked out racket. Huh. Interesting. It looks like he he was telling me that he went and got that professionally painted. Wow. And, uh, yeah. Very cool. All black, All black, black strings. Black, black leather grip. grip. Oh, my gosh. He... Did some work there for you. Absolutely. And then we've got our um, power. Uh, PWS. PWS, right. So that to me looks like a pro staff. How does it feel? It feels heavy. The throat is a little, um, I don't remember. Yeah, you're right. Something, this is I don't rounded. Know, I, yeah, it's... I don't know. That, that throws me off a little bit. But mm -hmm. It's got to be some type of pro staff. I would think, but is it's it... also pretty, you know thick right here that's versus, true that's versus true thin. it's thick here and then it kind of tapers off right. here it's like this is part is pro staff and this is something um something else right like this is thick right here in this part too right does this say anything wilson Four and wilson butt cap. five eights all right look at that butt cap look at that butt cap guys that's from way back in the day I don't think I've seen one of these butt cap in years. Right. There's X, A, Z on the butt cap. So does anybody know what that is? Is that St. Vincent? Is that anything that's worth anything? Probably not. <laughs> but somebody out there knows. I'll bet you somebody's going to chime in and say something. Um, well, let's go. Why don't we hit with it first? And then he's actually divulged what it is to oh. me. But and uh, but he wants you to 
test it out first and see what you think. All right, All let's right. go ahead. Let's go ahead. All right, so we just got off the court. Coach Rob and I hit with this mystery racket from my buddy, um, Anthony Bryant. Uh, and I guess this is for cricket, like I said. Let's be quiet for one second. You hear crickets? <laughs> I'm gonna swat the crickets with the cricket paddle. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's broken. I don't wanna hurt anybody hitting with the tennis ball with this. But, uh, <laughs> but Coach Rob, what did you think of the, the blacked out, customized, Wilson mystery racket. No, I yeah, like Tony. the mystery racket. Oh, yeah. T Tony, thank you. This was pretty cool. Um, I'm still stumped on what it is. Um, it still reminds me of a head when I look at this, which oh. isn't because you told me it's Wilson. So, in that, that I usually believe you unless it's NXT. It's got PWS, so I can't it, lie to you. That's true. Um, that wouldn't mean you wouldn't try. But, <laughs> um, but it felt pretty good. I hit some good shots with it. I kind of liked it. What, what did you feel? Um, it was a little light in the head, but I was able to get through it. I wasn't sure just, you know, the grip being a bigger grip size may have dispersed the weight a little bit, but, um, no, it was fun to play with. Yeah. No. So I felt, I'm still curious of what it is. <laughs> I'll tell you in a second. Cause he sent me pictures now that I told him. So here's the thing about this racket. It's wide here. It's wide here. And then thins out right here. So it is a taper beam racket. Do you recall any taper beam rackets from 30 something years ago? That was, I'll give you, this is the biggest hint that you're gonna get. It was purplish blue. Purplish blue. Yeah, depending on how the sun hit it, it could right. either look purple or it could look blue. Yeah, I kind of remember that. You was did? it like a 5-5 five, five pro staff? It was before that. Before it that? It was before that. It was 30-something okay. years ago. I can't remember what I had for lunch yesterday, so I'm not sure I'm going to remember 30 years ago. But So here's a picture of it. Well, actually, wait. Let me, let me tell you what I thought of this. Um, I really had no idea what this was either until he sent me the picture because it was, a pretty, it was a pretty popular racket when I was in high school. Like, one or two of the players actually used it. Um, I used it twice i let you know they let me in and i tried it and i'm like yeah this ain't for me um it came in a couple head sizes from what i remember or weights definitely colors it was definitely heavy here and light in the head i feel like it was one of those rare rackets that was extremely heavier here and light in the head and it wasn't a pro staff huh okay or maybe it had the name Pro Step on it, but it, it didn't deserve the name, like I said. Right, yeah. So this racket is an FPK. Do you remember the FPK racket? Blue, Wilson, FPK? No? I used... That might have been when I wasn't playing a lot. This was 1989. 88, 89 was when this racket was in its heyday. Okay. Yeah. So here's a picture of it right here. Thank you, Tony, for the pictures and for letting us forward to seeing that off picture. the hook. <laughs> yes. Um, but yeah, it's a, actually when I, what I remember about the racket was it was pretty flexible. It was pretty head light. The racket actually came through fast right. and I didn't like that. Gotcha. So back in this day, I used a uh, uh, Ultra 2. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. The, little, the little 80... 80 might have been 80 square inch head but it was super heavy right yeah you know, i needed that extra weight so this didn't really work for my stroke it didn't really work for my stroke today either. <laughs> <laughs> it worked for mine <laughs> felt fine for me but i think this will work better for my stroke right now that's true especially since it's broken <laughs> yeah i know damn it all right so thank, thank you, you tony, tony. Yeah, yeah thank you that was really a fun treat and uh, a mystery racket to try for sure yeah so, I wish I could have got it right, but or do it. <laughs> I mean, it's tough. It was a pretty obscure racket. I mean, it wasn't back then, but it was pretty obscure. It's pretty obscure now. Right. I don't really see many of these um, coming in into the shop. or coming into the <laughs> store. Yeah. So, 
So thank you, Tony, for customizing it and, uh, you know, making it the mystery racket of the yeah. day. Appreciate your time you spent blacking it out <laughs> and uh, getting it um, into position Excuse where me. we can't uh, recognize it. Yeah, so if I, if I sound a little weird to you, it's, uh, yeah, it's the pollen season. in the air. <laughs> yes. I wish I could squash the pollen. Um, me too. So, Coach Rob, thank you for... Uh, you know, playing with me as always sure. and trying out the mystery racket. Yep, definitely. Cool. Thank All you. Right. And thank you, Tony. Yeah. Guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Coach Rob, it's a little cold. I'm freezing, Harry. Keep moving your feet. <laughs> and it's dark. Ooh, I can't then barely see. Then you better not miss, Harry, because then you're going to get colder. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh, gosh. All right. Do you want that, pro? That will make you play in the dark, make you play in the freezing cold, not let you give up on your tennis. Well, I got my coach, Rob. You can get your coach, Rob, at Play Your Court. You can find over 27,000 players out there, coaches and playing partners, all at playyourcourt.com.